think you guys, you guys showed some fight in the third period, but uh, not so much in the second. What, what, what happened in that second period? Um, <clears throat> well, I think we got a little bit deflated after the first period. I thought we played a good first period. Take a penalty, get a goal, then another goal. Um, it would come out in the second period and just, we, we played, a, we just played uninspired hockey more than anything. Like, you know, turning pucks over and just loose. Um, and, you know, it got away from us. Greg, I asked Braden Shen this earlier, if that's more, I understand it's early and uh, the inconsistency is, is it more effort related or, or compete related? And he said both. Do you agree with that? And uh, do you feel like both of those showed tonight there? They, yeah, uh, but they're caused by attitude, in my opinion. Our attitude's got to be better. Um, you know, again, we've got to pull together as a team. That's what it's all about. And, you know, we, we've shown it at times and we won hockey games but again the consistency you know is not there um you know compete and work and all that that's attitude that's just all attitude you know why do you think the attitude dips i don't know you you should ask the players not me is it, is it uh, the, the three goals in the second period tonight you had two in the Colorado where you had four goals. Once you, once they give up goals, do things just kind of sag even more and things kind of snowball from there? Well, you're not very confident, that's for sure. Um, you know, you get on your heels and, you know, they, they took advantage of it. They, they, they played a strong game, I thought, you know. I thought we were good in the first period, like I said, and we gave up two late goals. So just, we got to just do a better job. Greg, are you able to gauge uh, Ville Husso's game tonight, knowing that there were a lot of, you know, uneven breaks and things like that? Yeah, I mean, obviously it's his first game, and you know, I'm not going to, I'm not going to comment on it too much. Greg, you know, you get uh, tired of the trends, but any rhyme or reason to what's going on in the second game of these series, all three of them? Um, I just, you know, I like I said, I. You know, you play these teams and you beat them in the first game and they're more desperate than us. Like, it seemed like that's what it boils down to. A lot of desperation, a lot of urgency uh, that, you know, the other team has a little bit more than we have. Um, we, you know, I think there's, you know, times where we do look okay and pretty good in the, in the second game. Uh, but it's definitely, you know, not consistent for 60 minutes. It's... Um, we definitely don't play very smart in the second games. Um, like I, we talked about playing smart and simple tonight, back-to-back -back games, um, things like that, but uh, we're not there yet. Greg, Brad, Vince Dunn had a couple uh, rough moments that led to goals. He just chalked this up to a bad night at the office for him. Who's that? Vince Dunn. Got to play better can't get walked one-on-one -on -one. i don't want i you know we'll just we'll, we'll keep that in-house and talk to him about it Greg, we've seen a lot of split series so far across the league has that made it more impressive what vegas has been able to do and i think they're seven and one entering this and could that be a bit of a wake-up call going in playing that? i'm not i'm not focused on vegas i don't care about vegas